Nikola Tesla invented certain new and useful improvements in the electromagnetic motor. This invention of Nikola Tesla can also be used for the transmission of power in an efficient way. So let us have a look at this invention. Welcome to my channel, Science, Engineering, Technology, Simplified. Nikola Tesla invented this electromagnetic motor to achieve the following objectives. The motor should rotate with uniform speed, irrespective of its load within its normal working limits. There should be a greater economy of conversion from mechanical energy to electrical energy, and vice versa. The apparatus should be cheap, more reliable, and simple. The apparatus must be capable of easy management, such that, all the danger from the use of currents of high tension, which are necessary for an economical transmission, must be avoided. So, let us see the construction of this electromagnetic motor. The motor comprises a ring, that is built up of thin insulated iron rings, or annular plates, so as to be, as susceptible as possible, to variations in its magnetic condition. This ring is surrounded by four coils of insulated wire, symmetrically placed. Now, the diametrically opposite coils are connected. Let us name these pairs of coils as, C, C, and C dash, C dash. Note. The wires in the diametrically opposite coils are wounded in the same direction, so as to cooperate in pairs in producing free pulls on diametrically opposite parts of the ring. Now, the four free ends thus left, are connected to the terminals, T, T, T dash, and T dash. Inside the ring there is a shaft, on which, a disc made up of steel is mounted. This disc has two segments cut away, but Tesla also found that this is not necessary, and a complete circular disc can also be used. This disc turns freely within the ring. There is also an alternate current generator that provides power to this electromagnetic motor. So, let us see the design of this AC generator. This generator has a field magnet and a cylindrical armature core, which should be split up. This armature core is wound with two coils, B and B dash. To avoid the use of commutator, the free ends of each coil are carried through the shaft and connected to the insulated contact rings, small b, small b, small b dash, small b dash. Now, to convey the current to and from the ring, brushes are attached to it. The terminals of these brushes are connected to the terminals T, T, T dash, and T dash. Let us name these wires as 1, 2, 3, and 4. Therefore, we get two complete circuits. So, let us take two different colors for easier understanding. First circuit includes the coil B of the generator and C, C of the motor. And the second circuit includes the coil B dash of the generator and C dash, C dash of the motor. Now, once again, carefully look at the design of this motor and generator and the wires connections between them because in next part of this video, we will see how this electromagnetic motor and the other design of electromagnetic motor works. So dear viewer, kindly like this video and subscribe to my channel. The next part of this video will be published soon.